There are many people who need ACE inhibitors in order to help them live a healthier life. This is a form of medication that is often used on patients who have high blood pressure, frequent migraines, and scleroderma which are a skin disease that can cause redness, blunts, and even blanching of the skin. The main effect of these inhibitors is to relax the blood vessels of the patient. This helps to keep your body from producing angiotensin E, which is a product in your body that affects your cardiovascular system. This product is what could lead to heart problems because it makes your heart work much harder. Other conditions that these ACE inhibitors or angioreceptor blockers are prescribed for include heart failure, chronic kidney diseases, heart attacks, scleroderma, and people who are plagued with migraines. Your doctor may also add other medications such as diuretics to your health plan as well. You will find that your doctor will inform you of side effects and dangers that you have to be aware of when taking these beta blockers or sometimes called calcium channel blockers. You will find that there are many ACE inhibitors on the market today that will only be prescribed by your doctor. This is because your health will determine which inhibitor is best for you to use. Some of these inhibitors include Benazepril, Captopril, Nolapril, Foginopril, Lisinopril, Moxipril, Prindapril, Quinapril, Remipril and Trandilapril. Many doctors will prescribe one of these medications for conditions such as coronary heart disease, high blood pressure, and diabetes. These risks need to be taken into consideration, but the effect that you will have on your life without having these ACE inhibitors would be much worse than the cautions. These side effects include having an increased blood potassium level, getting rashes, possibly being dizzy, experiencing lightheadedness, having changes in taste, and having a reduced appetite. Many people will often lose a certain amount of weight while they are taking these inhibitors, but this is usually watched closely by their doctor. It is a good idea to ask your doctor any questions that you may have about these drugs so that you are aware of what they are used for as well as what to expect while you are on them.